Hey, what's up? Welcome back in the project. In this lecture, we will work on this uh, delete account. If someone, uh, if the customer clicks this delete account, so we can show them some options if they really want to delete their account with us. So yes, they are able to delete their account. We are creating a page for them. The change underscore password page is done. Now we can close it, and. Uh, we will simply do something like uh, this I and mean, we can also close this style.css page as well now we'll scroll down to this page I mean the my account the main page my account.php and there we have uh, links or here you can see and we have created a variable local variable delete underscore account with this question mark sign so we can uh, simply include a page delete.php below or here in the page we'll simply copy this this piece of code and paste it here paste it and we'll say if delete account delete underscore account variable is active then include a page called delete underscore account dot php that we have not created yet but we are going just to create that page very simply I will just simply create a new file and inside that new file we will simply very very simply add an account uh, a form which action will be nothing for now and method will be post and we'll just close that form control is to save this page inside the customer folder and na uh, give a name name it delete underscore account dot php just save it I have saved it now uh, inside the form we need to just add uh, before the form we will add H2 take give some style to that like uh, text align center text align center and we'll say do you really want to delete your account H2 close that will be just a text we can wa uh, warn them uh, if they really want or not now we'll just create two uh, I mean two input types input takes one will be equal to submit type will be submit I mean and its name will be <coughs> yes and value will be yes I want okay in another input type will be same submit and its name will be is equal to no and value will be no I was joking that's very simple do less to save now just we have inside the form take we have to submit I mean buttons uh, to which we have assigned a name yes to the first one and the second one is uh, has a name no so we will take the data uh, if someone has clicked yes then we will uh, delete their account and if someone has clicked no we'll then uh, redirect them to our again to the main page that's it let's refresh the page and uh, now click this delete button so you can see do you really want to delete your account this is saying that we can simply use some BR takes to list to save um, I have inserted two BRs we can make some uh, I mean some space but one is enough I think so again control is to save fresh now uh, do you really want to delete your account we will also add a BR take at the top so that 
it can also come up uh, here yes and we can change the color of the text to blue color blue so let's do again save refresh mm -hmm, this is not good sky blue is very good sky blue control is to save refresh oh, oh. oh my god what we are doing can keep it white control is to save I think that black was okay I have removed that okay now do you really want to delete your account yes if they click yes I want no I was joking so if they click on the joking part so we can tell them that do not joke again <laughs> and yes I want we will delete their account or oh, simply start the PHP script over here after the font take and first of all we will include the database here includes db.php we don't need to include this database here because this is already included uh, I think this is not included over here if we include it in the main page I mean uh, my underscore account.php then we don't need to add it here but since we can uh, we are doing things carefully so that is okay first of all we will say user equal to dollar uh, underscore session so using session variable we can just get the customer uh, underscore email the active user I mean the logged in user session so after that we will simply say if a set is set dollar underscore post yes if yes is set then what to do is set yes then we can simply create a variable uh, delete customer is equal to my SQL uh, sorry we'll write a query inside it we'll say delete from customers where customer underscore email is equal to this one this person that we have the user I mean inside the session we have the email of that person who is logged in and we'll simply say delete sorry uh, run underscore customer is equal to we don't need to actually uh, use this variable basically we directly can say that uh, oh mysqli and query and we can directly say connection and we can say uh, connection and th then this variable that is delete customer we can also do like this but we are uh, we, we are creating the variable that for simplicity you know and we can later on uh, actually use that again somewhere for validation or for checking or for comparison or things like that therefore we are just creating a local variable uh, like anything uh, run customer or something like that and we call that to the query so this is a safe way to use the to I mean to save the query inside a variable so that's it and we can say echo inside the script take can just uh, give them an alert uh, we are really sorry your account has been deleted that's it because we are very sorry we are very sad because the person is going outside our website and going forever and we will redirect the person to actually to the main page window dot open uh, double dot backslash and index dot php because that is outside the main directory I mean outside this directory the customer one in a self window will open that's it and uh, we can simply uh, 
do something like uh, just copy this and we'll paste it here if is set no then we will put some this two echoes over here and we'll say oh not joke again <laughs> and we will redirect the person to my underscore account not php that's it all we need to do control s to save and now come press the page again they click no i was joking will say oh do not joke again okay and he she he or she has has taken back to the home page i mean my account they click again yes i want this time the person is gonna be deleted this click we are really sorry your account has been deleted okay and they have been taken back to this page and now you can find here there is no user there is no customer because that customer has been deleted so we have done all we needed or here uh, you know for deleting account and for this customer user interface we can later on uh, register one more customer or any other customers but now we need to start work on the admin panel for this whole project so we can manage all the content through admin panel stay tuned